Hey, what's going on guys? Chris Altamirano here, and I'm actually about to head to the gym right now, but before I head out, I wanna show you something inside. Check this out. This right here is Enagic Kangen water, right? Now, before I even explain what that is, I wanna explain to you exactly what's in your tap water. We have chlorine, there's arsenic, there's this stuff that's, uh, that the government puts in it called lye, it's spelled L-Y-E. Again, I'm not some engineer or a scientist or something, but go do your research online. It's in your water, right? And so basically, there's also chlorine in it. And so what I have here is these, uh, this is called orthotolidine, right? It's these little chlorine indicator drops. And uh, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna test this tap water and we're gonna test this kangen water. Now what this is gonna do is it's gonna indicate whether or not the water has chlorine in it. I don't know about you, but I don't wanna be drinking chlorine, right? I mean, would you go to your friend's house and say, hey, can I get a, a, a capsule of, of Clorox? Could you put that in my water? It makes me feel clean. You're not gonna do that. Don't do that. So let's put the drops in here, see, see what happens. Put the drops in the kangen water. Now remember, if it turns yellow, if it turns yellow, Excuse the mess behind, by the way, actually. Those are actually all clean. If it turns yellow, that means there's chlorine in it. Look at that. Put the drops in both of them. Do you see any yellow in there? No. What about this one? Look at how yellow that is from the top, too. Look at that, right? So that's what you're putting in your body every time you go and drink tap water, right? And if you're someone, you're out there like, oh, I drink bottled water, I'm so fancy. Listen, before the bottled water actually hits your lips, it's probably been sitting on a shelf for over a year anyway. So there's all these chemicals that leach into the water from the plastic that don't do you any good as well, right? So you definitely need to change your water. So you need to make an educated decision. So check this out. How about showering, right? Your organ, your skin is your biggest organ. So you're constantly absorbing all this chlorine every time you shower. I'm gonna show you exactly how that works right now. Right here we have this lime. This represents you taking a shower. Let's put you in the water. Let's see what happens, all right? We're just gonna put that lime in there. Just gonna give it a couple of stirs. Notice anything different about this, about this water? Look at what happens, it's already gone. You just, you literally, you ju your skin just absorbed all of that chlorine. That's why when you get out of the shower, you feel super dry. Ladies, I, I know you especially, you know, my mom uses the, the St. Ives or the Aveeno lotion, because why? Because every time you're done taking a shower, your skin is extremely dry. Why is it dry? Because of the chlorine in the water. It's the same concept when you're out and you're swimming on a hot summer's day, the, the chlorine, I mean, these, these drops, this is the same stuff that your, your pool man uses to test your, your, your chlorine levels. It's the same type of drops. You can go to your pool store and get them for yourself. Don't take my word for it. But look, it's the same reason why you go to the pool and you're swimming and your skin's extremely dry and you're like, man, I can't wait to get home and take a shower. You're really just taking the same type of chlorinated shower, except there's just less chlorine in the water that you're taking a shower in. So definitely want to keep you educated on exactly what's going on in your body, in your water systems, what you're putting on your body, what you're putting in your body, the types of beverages that you're consuming. And look, if you care about anyone at all, if you care about your health, get back to me, right? Or get back to the person that showed you this video. Or if you care about someone else's health, tag them in this video right now. You owe it to them to help educate them. Again, this isn't about trying to, you know, sell anybody anything. This is about education, right? I feel like the more that I can educate you, you can just make an educated decision and a more educated decision for yourself. And you either care about your health or you don't. I'm Chris Altamirano. Thanks for watching this video. Tag your loved ones. Thanks for watching.